Shut it all down. Everybody shut down the whole different vibe. But this defense, the defense, we just came in and said, keep getting stops. Like we all, we trust our offense. We all understand. We understood, understood coming out of halftime that um, our offense is explosive. It's not, it's not easy, hard for them to put up 28 points. So we just kept said we're gonna keep getting stops, keep getting stops. And we probably, I mean, I think we got like seven, seven in a row. I mean, they're not giving no points in the second half. That was, that's big. I mean, so we got something to build off of. I mean, this is not, this is not the um, end. This is just the beginning for us. So that's how we look at it. Uh, Cam, how would you describe you guys' performance tonight and, and this night for you guys as a team? Um, learning experience. I say it was a um, very, very good learning experience. I mean, um, we kind of figured out who who we was to be exact. I mean, how, who players is, who gonna shut it down, who gonna keep bringing it. I mean, I'm just uh, I'm all around just proud proud of the um, front line, uh, DBs, linebackers. I mean, these guys never never went away, never shot away. We kept coming. You know, we, we got some positives to get out of, so. Brian, go ahead. Cam, uh, the coach was you know, saying you got to tip your hat uh, to them at some point. Yeah, fact. Uh, they, they sort of played like a team that they were tired of losing their rivals mm -hmm. three times in a row, yeah. and the atmosphere was pretty electric. Did you guys maybe get overwhelmed a little bit by the atmosphere? Maybe not you, but like as a team? Oh no, nah, I don't think I don't think we got overwhelmed. To be honest, I mean the lights didn't get too bright for us, and nobody I've seen nobody eyes. So I don't say we got overwhelmed. I feel like they just um they just came out and played. They just came out and played uh, better. To be honest, they came out and played better. You know, we fought we fought back at the end, but they just came out and balled out. Them guys flew around, made plays. Um, it had a great had a great coaching staff over there. Put them in great position. And so um, yeah, they just came out. They just came out flat because I don't think the atmosphere kind of just overwhelmed us. It was an awesome atmosphere. Jake, go ahead. Cam, how do you balance like the progress you guys have obviously made from the start of last year to some of the mistakes that kind of pop up again and again sometimes? Um, kind of just go to the practice field, go to the film room, and um, be very nick picky on how we messed up, what we messed up on a lot of things. I messed up on a lot of things. Um, so it's just uh, people just looking in the mirror. You know what I'm saying? I feel like the guys in the locker room is a whole different vibe because these guys, we want to be better. Like these guys not making excuses on why we should have won or why we did it and why we do this. But um, we really looked at each other in the mirror. Like I went there and told them guys like I'm proud of them that we got something to build off of. So, um, yeah, it's just just get back in the film room and get back to work hard. Nothing changed. I mean, our plan is still our plan. I mean, this is this, just a hiccup in the road. I mean, turn all your ears to list. So, I would really. Ken, this is two games in a row now that it seems like Coach Livingston has made some pretty solid adjustments at halftime. What, what is he saying to you guys in the locker room that's kind of resonating that you guys are able? I think it's only six points allowed in the second half so far. It's, it's, it's not more of the adjustment he made, it's the man he is. I mean, um, it's just playing for him. I mean, he, the, the way he, his passion, that he talked to you and how. He don't put belief in you. I mean, it's like it's just a guy you'll run through a wall for. So, and we got that feeling all over the defense. I mean, it's a it's a tribe mentality. I mean, he's just the chief. So we were do do everything for him and run through a wall for him. So it's really not the adjustment he made. He made some great adjustments. Don't get me wrong, but it's more of like um, we really like we really have love for our DC and not each other. Matt, go ahead. What's it gonna take for you guys to come with that energy that you've been finding in the second half right out it, of the game? It come, it's calm. I mean, we got a lot of guys that never played with each other. We kind of learned. I mean, you can. It's one thing to sit on the practice field and see what a guy does and walk around, walk around, see who he is. But it's different when they get them lights come on. You get to look in their eyes, and you, so we really just figuring each other out. I mean, I've, I've learned a lot today just about my guys up front and defense. I mean, I learned so much. So um, it's it's a learning experience for sure. I mean, we're gonna be we're just gonna get better and better than this. It's not it's not the end, like I said. Thank you, Bill. Um, yes, uh, Nebraska does have a new quarterback, but when you're on the field, how does this offense feel different from last year's Nebraska? From Nebraska? Yeah. Are they um this last year? I mean, for the most part, they were the same. I mean, we watched a lot of the last year film, and um they kind of did a lot of the same thing. They want to run the ball. I mean, they had some they had three big backs. I mean, that's coming down here. But the, they added a shot. They take and take a shot. So they can, we prepare for the shot they would take. I mean, roll right, throw across, throw across the field. I mean, that that was something they were doing last year. So um, yeah, he's an awesome, awesome quarterback. I mean, he got a lot of got a lot of room to grow. He's gonna be he's gonna be good. So um, it was a, it was a little adjustment. Um, just your thoughts on Shiloh going out? How difficult that loss was for you, you guys in the secondary? Um, it was it was very difficult. I mean, last year we kind of um, I mean not last. I'm sorry, last week. We kind of, me going down kind of hit us across the head and it was like opening everybody's eyes up. So this week we came in where the guys behind us kind of came in with a different mentality, um, ready to play up front, I mean, ready to play off the rip. So when he went down, um, it was just on a next guy up mentality. Last one for Cam, Lincoln, go ahead. Yep. Thank you, sir. Uh, so you guys have been so good in the second half. Uh, what's the 
Do you feel that the stronger play of the second half was a potential step forward for this defense? Oh, definitely. I mean, because we had every reason to shut down. It's 90-some 90, 90 thousand people in the stands. We down 28-0, nothing falling for our way. I mean, the play before half, a guy tipped the ball four times, caught it, and scored. We had every reason to shut it down, and we came out with a different mentality than we came out of uh, set them guys out in the second half. So we got something to grow off of, and I'm proud of that. All right, Cam, Appreciate y'all.